What is going on guys? Welcome back to another brand new Division 2 video. In today's video, I want to talk a little bit about the Ubisoft Club Store and everything that you are able to get from that for pretty much free. So hopefully you guys do find this video helpful. If you guys do, make sure you guys drop a like and a subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. And let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so getting right into it, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about in terms of the Ubisoft Club, uh, I'm on Xbox One and when you're on your main menu on the actual game itself, uh, you can scroll over to the Ubisoft Club right here, as you can see. It's going to take a second to load. And then when you are on the application, uh, you will have to sign in, I believe, or it may be linked to the uh, the account that your Xbox or PlayStation account is linked to as well in terms of email. But uh, you guys can see that it has challenges, uh, rewards, stats, and leaderboards, which is super, super cool. If you have a lot of people added, you can see how much time you have, like how many kills you have. But going over to the challenges, this is pretty much how you get the Ubisoft points, which you're able to use to buy a ton of different stuff on here. There's daily and weekly, and then there's just regular things that you can get from like completing random missions and stuff like this that you pretty much just earn and complete from just straight up playing the game. So moving on to the rewards, you guys can probably already tell I've bought a couple of them. Um, I do also want to make note for you guys that uh, these rewards are all only redeemable and buyable, I guess, uh, one time. So once you redeem them, once you buy them, uh, you cannot buy them again and redeem them. So I just want to throw that out there so you guys don't think you're able to just sit here and keep on buying all of these e-currency packs or all these specialized material packs and just rack up uh, tons of money in the game. Unfortunately, it doesn't work like that. Uh, I believe in Division 1, you could buy them like three or four times each, and then they would lock. But in this game, they're only letting us buy it once, and that's it. But uh, quickly, I do want to go through and show you guys some of the important ones that I would recommend buying if you guys are a new player. You have the e-currency pack, uh, which is 400 e-credit. It isn't a lot, but it is better than nothing. And then you have your two specialized material packs. That's going to give you the carbon fiber, electronics, titanium. And then the other one's going to give you the ceramics, polycarbonate, and the steel, which could be used for uh, crafting weapons and whatnot. And then you have a specialized MPX. Uh, this is actually a blue, I believe it'll give you. Uh, it's like level two or three. I know it's not that good, but it is pretty decent in terms of the beginning of the game. And then you got a couple of wallpapers. Uh, I will go down here and show you guys these two weapon skins because uh, I believe both of these are from playing open beta and closed beta or open beta and closed beta. I'm not sure, uh, but I believe that's what these two skins are from. And then quickly, uh, I will buy this uh, suit for my character, this outfit, so that I can show you guys uh, how to get it on your character and how to get it in your inventory. Alright guys, so you guys can see on the top right of the screen, it did just say that I did redeem the Agent Johnson outfit. So what you're going to want to do is go to any stash and any safe house. Uh, I'm just at the base of operations, so that's where I'm going to do it at. Open your stash, and you go all the way over to your mailbox, which has deliveries and grants in it. And you're going to click on the grant section, and there you guys can see that the boots, the shirt, and the jeans or the pants are all there, which is going to be the full set that I just paid the 50 credits for. And simply all you do is you move them to your inventory, go back over to your character apparel, and then they will be in my inventory for all the stuff that I currently already own. Since they are blue, I know that they are specialized, and there they are in my inventory. But lastly, I just want to throw the leaderboard section in the end of the video for you guys so you guys can see how much of a life that I really do not have. Already a half day's worth of game time uh, on the Division 2. Uh, but I just think it's really cool that they added this on the app again, uh, that you're able to see pretty much like any stat in general, and it, you can also compare it with people that you have added on this app, so I thought that was pretty cool. But other than that, that's uh, that's pretty much going to do it. I mainly wanted to make this video for people that, uh, that really didn't know much about the Ubisoft Club app, uh, and also for some people that were wondering like how to get their skins and uh, all the rewards that they accomplished on Division 1 in terms of like their... Uh, their shields and whatnot so for people that want to get those i guess that sort of helped in a way too on how to get the rewards and skins and stuff like that but a lot of people just rack up all these points on the ubisoft club app uh just from playing the campaign and completing missions and accidentally completing checkpoints and getting xp and stuff like that on the app and it kind of just sits there and i mean it's free in a way so you might as well use it to get free weapons uh free gear sets for your character or free outfits i should say uh you know like a lot of stuff that could help your character in a way if you're pretty much just starting the game and really don't have a good idea uh, of how everything works quite yet. So that's the reason why I wanted to make the video. 
But other than that, guys, that is pretty much it. Um, hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. I want to keep it short and sweet to the point because it's pretty easy to use the app and it's pretty basic. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Thank you guys for watching the video. If you guys did enjoy or find it helpful, make sure you just drop a like and a subscribe channel if you guys are new. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.